Happy Friday, it's dinner time. Can you see where we're at? We haven't been to Golden Corral, Why? where am I looking? We haven't been to Golden Corral since like Thanksgiving. So this should be fun. And we're at Golden Corral in case you couldn't see it a second ago. Are you excited, Mike? What are you gonna get? Disappointment. Disappointment, probably. <laughs> So I started off at the salad bar. They actually have it to where you serve yourself now. For a while, Golden Corral had it to where they were serving you. So I did lettuce, some baby corns. If you didn't know, baby corns are super low in carbs. Some green bell pepper, some hard boiled egg, some diced ham, grilled chicken, pepperoni, some cucumbers, and some onions, and a few little broccoli florets. I probably won't eat this whole plate, but I do <laughs> love their salad. This is Mike's salad, which always cracks me up because he puts like five gallons of shredded cheese and ranch on it. I put ranch on mine too, by the way, I forgot to mention that. But uh, I couldn't find the shredded cheese when I was up there and I'm too lazy to go back up. So I'll just look at his cheese and admire it. Mike got some- Mystery loaf. Mystery meat loaf. <laughs> I just had a bite, it is, uh, I don't think it's beef. What do you think? Ostrich? Rat. Armadillo, maybe? Definitely rat. <laughs> it tastes weird. Okay, I just got back from the hot food bar. So I got a little bit of, ooh, something on my finger. I got a little bit of green bean casserole, some fried jalapenos, some carrots, some steamed cabbage, and then I put the cheese sauce on top of it. If you've never had cheese sauce on top of cabbage, it's so good some pulled pork, and then a chicken, piece of chicken. Okay, so now I got a piece of ham and beef, Texas beef, is that what it's called? That's what I said. And then I got some more green bean casserole because that was pretty good. If I look sweaty, it is not from the outside heat, it is because it was hot as balls in Golden Corral. Annoying. So I definitely ate too much, which is unfortunate because that food was like five out of 10. Like not worth it, not worth to overeat on. But you know, I struggle with uh, buffets because I'm not only a former obese girl, I'm a former poor girl. So I wanna always like get my money's worth. So I like always overeat when we go to a buffet, even if it's not good. <laughs> oh, I didn't end up eating the chicken or the beef that I showed you. There was no chicken or beef there. <laughs> they were just like, they weren't good. They were like the beef. I think it was smoked beef, but it had like no flavor. It was a very weird texture. Same with the chicken. Very, very strange. So the ham was good, but also I could tell that the ham was very sugary, which is probably why it was good. And the green bean casserole was good but it's hard to fuck that up, so. Anyways, hopefully we eat better tomorrow. We're home now and Mike won't stop being inappropriate. <laughs> What's your, what do you think is the best thing Golden Corral has? I'll go first. <laughs> I think it's the banana pudding. That is literally like my most favorite thing at Golden Corral and I get sad every time we go there that I like I just don't eat it I don't even eat a little bit because I won't want a little bit I'll want a lot so I don't even walk over to the dessert area so if they have like sugar-free or fruit or whatever I don't even know because I don't even walk over there <laughs> what do you think people watching people watching it is kind of like Walmart at 2 a.m. I don't know about your guys' Golden Corrals, but our Golden Corral, there's always like some characters there. Where if you just like sit close enough to like a good table, you are entertained fully for like the hour that you're there. Anything to add about your Golden Corral experience? Don't go there. <laughs> don't go there? We go there every holiday. We go there on Thanksgiving and on Christmas because we don't have family. And we don't cook for just us. So we go to go and growl. <laughs> it's really depressing. <laughs> well, we'll see Golden Corral again on Thanksgiving. No, we won't. 